Hi, hello friends. In this uh, video, we will talk about how to read a uh, cervical spine x-ray. The Normally, the cervical spine uh, curvature should be C-shaped. It should be like this. The dorsal should be like this. And lumbar should be again like this. So, this is the cervical, this is the dorsal and uh, this is the lumbar. So, here you can clearly see there is a loss of cervical ordosis. So first you have to see the alignment, then you have to see the disc space. So whether the disc space is maintained or not. So in this video first we will learn how to uh, point out which is the first and second vertebra. The conical shape vertebra is the second one. Phone foot call. So the conical shape vertebra is the second one. So this is the second vertebra, uh, C2's spinous process. This is a C1, this is a C2, this is a C3, this is a C4, this is a C5, this is a C6. So you can clearly see from uh, above bottom, top to bottom, 2, 3, 4, 5. So 5, 6 and 6, 7 disc space is bit narrowed when compared to the other vertebra. And you also should observe for the osteophytes. You can see the osteophytes here, anterior osteophytes. There can be posterior osteophytes as well. These posterior osteophytes are very important. So, along with disc bulges? Yeah, along with the disc bulges. To see the disc bulge, again we have to go for the MRI scan. So, you, have, you should also see for any fractures, if there are any fractures in the bone. I should also see for the density, bone density. How is the bone? quality of the bone, are there any lytic lesions, should also check for any uh, soft tissue swellings, sometimes there can be abscess, so all these things should be checked, so to summarize, number one is the alignment, whether normal alignment is maintained or not, usually the cervical spine will be like this, C shape, so whether it is maintained or not, here there is a loss of cervical lordosis whether the disc space is maintained or not, whether there are any osteophytes, whether there are any fractures. In case of any trauma, should always suspect for fractures and always better go for a CT scan in case of trauma, in case of any fractures. So how is the bone quality? How is the bone density? How, uh, if you have got any doubts, always correlate, uh, speak with the, I mean, uh, consult uh, neurosurgeon or orthopedic surgeon and if needed, always advise for a cervical spine MRI. So, because X-ray will tell only few things. It cannot tell everything. So, it will tell only the basic things. So, for detailed uh, details, for further details, so better go for a MRI scan. So, I hope this video is helpful to you. Thanks for watching friends. Bye.